three times. Okay, um, I've got, I found. I drug out an old frame that I've had and I put one of them blocks in there so I'd have a picture of mom's block out here all right so now then we have our block so I'm gonna show you how to get the pattern off of here okay I have freezer paper <clears throat> I'm going to pull me some off. I'm going to pull that thing back up. And I'm going to lay it out at the very top. I'm going to get me a marker. And I'm going to draw out the hat. Alright, there's one pattern complete. Now we're going to do an arm right here. And now we've got a hand. And what we're going to do is we're going to go up on the hand and draw it out. So there's the hand. I'm hoping y'all will see it pretty good. I'm really not. Let's see. Can you see how I brought back and I drawed it bigger than I needed it? And then the arm is just right. And then here is the hat. Alright. Now we have a basket right here. <clears throat> and I want the basket. So I'm going to go up, over, down, and just go right around the basket. And now we have a basket that we could put in here. So now we have the hat, <clears throat> the arm, the hand, and the basket. Now we're going to work on the dress. Pull it out here. Let's see. Right here is the end. There's, okay, I got the whole dress in here. Okay. So now I'm going to go from up here, and I'm going to draw me a line across, and then down. And I'm going to keep on the going with the dress. Okay, now I'm here. Now we got all that stuff right here. Now we're just going to take it and just draw it straight up. My ink has quit. <laughs> Alright, now we got a shoe. Alright, now we're going to take the shoe and we're going to go up on the shoe like that. And we're going to go down and then we're going to go up. And around. So, now we have everything that we need for the girl. Now, I have already done, drawed out the boy the same identical way. <clears throat> Here is his pants. And if you notice, I went up right here. Where, he's, where his hat is, and then down and around. So we are to be able to work it out really good there. Alright, now we got back here is his shirt. And the way we want to cut this one out is we want to cut it right here. We want to go up like that and then around, down through here and around. Okay, and then back down this way. This right here, we're not even going to pay attention to. And then we have his hat, and then we have his shoe. Alright, now, we have that. Now, we are going to cut out 
the shoe and we're not looking for perfect okay because it will come out perfect all right there is a shoe now with his hat we are going to cut it in half we are going to take the hat and we are going to fold it okay in half okay now you have either this side you can see there's two of them here I'm hoping now you can pick whichever side you want and you can cut it out I like the back side so we're going to cut it out okay I just like the way the um, curves are alright I went up a little bit because I like it better that way alright now we have his hat cut out I am happy with that All right, now we have the shirt. We're going to do it the same way. Cut it in half, or put it in half. Now we're going to cut it out. Do you like the back one better or the front one better? To me, it don't really matter. It looks good all the way around. So, I, oh, I'm going to cut it out. I'm doing it this way so I can hopefully get to it right. Alright, now I have this little tip right here. Like that. Now we have that for his, the guy's shirt. <clears throat> Alright, now we got those pieces out. Now we have the pants to go. We're going to fold our pants in half, and you should be able to find it pretty good. Now then, do you like the back one better or the front one better? And there is your your Sam's britches. All right. Now here we are with the girl. Now the hat is pretty well much. All theirs is pretty well much the way that it has to be. So now all we have to do is cut out everything that's the girl's. If you want to make any changes to it, make them. Now we have our pattern. Now if you want to transfer it to some plastic like this, you could transfer it. Oh, it don't look like you can dress unless you got something bigger. But the arms, the hand, the basket, the shoe. Oh, I wonder if I can get the hat on here too. Let's try with the hat first. There would be the hat, basket, and shoe, and hand. Wouldn't be able to get it all on there.
but you can get where I'm coming from. Um, I think I've already done got. No, nope. I think I've already done got um, the uh, this one cut out, except for the basket. So I am not going to cut it out, but as you can tell, that's how you cut it out. I don't think I need to. So, alrighty, we will be back in a little bit. Alright, I have them all cut out. Here is her hat. Here is his hat. Alright. Here is his body. Then here is his clothes. Now I get cut half, and it's just cut on fold, and this one is cut on fold. And it'll go in there like that. Alright, and here is her dress. Her hat will be right on top of it. Here is her sleeve, her hand, her basket, her shoe. And his shoe. So now we have them all cut out. So I am going to go in and think how what I want in the background. Well, I have to come up with a background. All right, I'll see you in a few. All right, I know it's backwards to you, but I think this is what I'm going to put them on, and they're going to go right down here at the bottom. And it makes it look like they're on a beach, and they have all these uh, boats out in here, which I think is going to look good on it. So I'm only going to want two of them. So we're going to cut out two of them. And now I have a whole bunch of material here to go with and see which one I like the most. I think I'm going to pass on them. That's too, I think, yeah. Um, I'm not quite for sure what I want here. But I know those go together. And then here we got some kind of white, and brown, and pink, red. And then that color I just got done with. And that. I think the guy's pants would look good in this red. And I think I'm going to put his shirt this color. Now we have that. Um, let's see. What can we make their boots out of? I think this would look good as her dress or this one her dress. Yeah, I think I might have enough for her dress on that. Her dress. And here's her sleeve right here. And we need a little piece for her basket. If I can find a little piece here. This will work for her basket. <clears throat> Alright. Now then, let's see. I think that will work on that. Alright, and this is the man's shirt and pants right here. Uh, we have to have a hat. Which one would look better for a hat? I think this one would look better for a hat. So here is a hat. Oh, that's his hat. This is her hat. Let's make her shoes the same color. Her shoe, the same color. And now we have a hand and uh, 
a shoe and a, the farmer's hat. We're going to make the farmer's hat out of this. So therefore, now all we have is a hand and a shoe. And I'm going to put this over here. I'm going to do my stuff here. We have a man shoe and a hat. Get this up here. All right, let's see what I'm. No, that's not. <laughs> and I got the cat right there. <laughs> All right, let's see what we can find in our scrap. Here is. Well, here's a brown. And we can make the hand and the shoe out of that. All right. So, and I can cut that in half. See, do it that way and that way, and cut it right down. All right. So now, hat, uh, shirt, and pants. That works and that works. All right. So now then, let's see what we can do about start cutting these out and getting these done. Alright, let's see. Um, here's my scissors. And I am going to freestyle it.
All right, we have all these right here cut out. So now let's put them together. This is the woman's hat, the woman's shoe. Here is her dress. So we're going to put that there. And here is her arm, her hand, her shoe. All right, where's her basket? Oh, here's her basket. So now we have all the woman. All right, here is the man's clothes. Let me open it up if I can. It's going to go like this, and the hand is going to go over top. Let's go down. And this one's going to go over top. All right, now we got a problem here. It doesn't want to go. So what we're going to do is fold the outfit like this. And we're just going to make a little slit right here in the middle. Stop! dog. Alright, lay it back down here and then we're going to put the arms right back over here. Alright, it's still not going to go. Let's cut just a little bit off the uniform here. Get it lined up there. And we're going to cut a little bit off of it. Now we're going to see if it'll work. Lay it down. Arm. And arm. Now we have it. Here is the man's hat. And here's one of his boots. We need another one. We can do it. I'm pretty sure we could do another boot. Alright. Could do the girl's boot and put it on. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and do this, and I will see you all later. You can go ahead and turn it off. Good morning, you guys. All right, let's take these off, and we want to uh, take a look at what we want to put it on. So... Let's see what we can do here. I'm just now waking up and starting my day. Alright, now the first thing I want to do is I want to cut this down to where it's not so big to play with. Because I want to be able to get it into the... Um, underneath the sewing machine and turn it around and all that good stuff so what I'm going to do first is I'm going to cut oh let's see what we got here we have got 28 and a half I think what I'm going to do is cut it down to about 14. Okay. And we'll set this aside. We can use it on the back or something like that. Now, let's see. I think... Cut it down again. Oh yeah, we'll cut it down again. Right here on this fold will look good to me. I want to make sure it's even. See, I would have cut it at crooked. I don't want it crooked. And I got it at 24 here. So, now that I got it down to where I can pretty well much manage it. Yes. That's what I'm looking for. How big it is. 
Alright. Let's get our stuff back up here. And we're going to do the man right here. <clears throat> Get him all lined up there. There. Now we'll work on the girl. Oh man, he sh she should be over here and he should be there. <clears throat> we'll get it right. I think that looks pretty good. I think my mind was great on this. <clears throat> Alright. See here? I think that looks pretty good. Really good. Now we have to sew these down. <clears throat> Let's make sure that right there is where we want them. I don't want to cut down in here and make two because when you sew it back together again this uh, ship will not look good or boat whatever you want to call it. I think he needs to be moved up just a tad There we go. Alright, now we know the hats are going to be sewed on last, so we're going to take them completely off. Put them to the side. Alright, we need our pins. It's cold out here. And we know these are going to be put on last. We need the shoe, her shoe. We're going to pin it down. And now his shoes are going to be put on first, too. So, we are going to pin them down. And now, I'm going to, um... Yeah, let's zigzag it all the way around. Alright, we got, our, got the shoes on. And I changed my stitch. I think I'm going to like that one better on it. So, now then, we want to go up to our next level here. We'll put, oh, come on. Everything's catching on my finger. Which will go right here. And gotta go up, 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 up. Till we get that one right. All right, now, on the shirt, we're just going to leave it, everything like it is, and sew it all down. So what you want to do is you want to go around the shirt, okay, then go around this right here, and then come down here and start right here and go all the way around it. So I'm going to pin it down. And we got a lot of sewing to do on this one. But we can do it. Alrighty. Now then, the girl. We have the dress next. And we're going to pin.
pin it down and we're going to put it on. Mama Cat, she's just going nutty. That's all. I like the scenery behind it. Alright, I'm going in for a few before, because it's cold out here and I need to warm my fingers up. We've got our arms to do next and our hands. It's going to look pretty. I'm going to like it. Alright, I'll be back. put a quick note in here this shirt that I made I cut five inches off the sleeves on each side see how much I cut off well really I think it's about ten yeah about ten inches off of it and I like it better I didn't like how big they was and um uh, so I figured I'd do that all right I need to sew down that now but I just could not stand them sleeves no more uh, Gwen said that uh, I should put elastic in them and I told Rick what she, what she said and he said you won't like it you won't like it I said well okay then I won't do it he says you're better off to try to make them smaller I have a t-shirt underneath I don't know if you noticed it or not all right let's get busy all right, let's look at the way I sewed down the man's pants. Now, this does not have to be sewed, nor this. And I did not sew across here because the hat will cover it. So, let's just take a look at it. Let me lay it down there. So, you see here how the hat covers it? So, we don't have to worry about sewing that up there because it will be... Uh, covered all right so now we got the hat to do on the boy uh oh I just dropped you I didn't mean to I guess that was a personal choice all right let's lay this right here level like that throw some pins in there and it is ready to be sewed down and the last on the boy. <clears throat> now we've got several things on the girl. <clears throat> we have her basket, her sleeve. Oh no, her hand is gone. Oh no. Alright. I gotta look for her hand or cut another one out. Alright, I couldn't find it, so I had to cut another one. It'll be okay. Alright, so we want to like that. Why don't you go away? Okay. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> let's get her hat the way we want it. Get rid of strings. It'll show up now that I just went and made another one. <laughs> That's just the way things go. Alright, I'm going to sew these down and get these done. Oh, come on, get in there. There's the hand, get the basket. Okay. All right, I'm going to get these sewed, and I'll see you all the next tutorial. All right. 